Mr. President, distinguished uh, colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, as your chairperson of the Senate Committee on National Defense and Security, Peace, Unification, and Reconciliation, I have the honor to present a bicameral conference committee report on the disagreeing provisions of Senate Bill Number 1480 and House Bill Number 7939. This is the bill rationalizing the disability pension of our veterans, further amending for the purpose Republic Act 6948, an act standardizing and upgrading the benefits for military veterans and other dependents. Mr. President, I would like to thank our fellow conferees for, from the House of Representatives, led by Congressman George Patrol Bustos, Chairperson of House Committee on Veteran Affairs and Welfare, for agreeing to use the Senate version as the working draft. The two short bills, may I, may I emphasize, have very minor differences and actually propose similar rates of, of increase for the monthly disability pension for our veterans. Section 1 of the Senate version was adopted, which simplified the, and clarified the provision on who will be entitled to the total administrative disability pension. Long title of the original law, which is Republic Act number 6948. Mr. President, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to our esteemed colleagues and members of the Senate panel, Senator Grace Poe and our Minority Floor Leader, Senator Aquilino Coco Pimentel III, for their invaluable support to this long overdue measure. The members of the House panel, Congressman Bustos, House Committee Vice Chairpersons, Congresswoman Mar Marlene Primicias Agabas, and Congresswoman Milagros Aquino Magsaysay, as well as Congresswoman Geraldine Roman and Congressman Sergio Dagoo who are all authors of this, of this bill. bill. Mr. President, I respectfully move that we, that we adopt, adopt and ratify the bicameral conference, conference committee report on the disagreed provisions of Senate Bill 1480 and House Bill 7939. Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President.